these 10 Android applications has gained mentions in several Android apps videos this year and I'm going to show you why. In no random order, the first application is called Rewind and ever since the beginning of this year, most best Android apps videos never go by without mentioning this application. And you will clearly understand why because it allows you to go back in time and listen to some old time music. Whether some common songs you used to hear during your childhood you can actually enter the particular year and you'll be able to listen to some hit records from that year. Even though you cannot actually listen to the entire song, you can imagine the feeling when you remember you used to dance to some of these tunes back in the day. Pixel Search is undoubtedly another Android application which has gone viral the whole of this year and the reason being, the application brings the device search feature on only Pixel devices to any Android smartphone. With Pixel Search, you can easily find anything on your device. With a simple search, the application will search through your apps, files and folders from your phone storage, your contacts and even get you results from the web. So with a simple search, you can get results both locally and on the web without you having to open many applications. I'm a huge fan of Pixel devices and their highly saturated software and the interface and user experience of Pixel Search is what I really love about this application. The universal search feature this application brings is what I think has popularized it and I'm sure everyone loves better functionality. I seriously can't have enough of this application called Seal. This app has been one of the most mentioned applications in several best Android apps videos. Why? Because you can download videos or audios from streaming platforms very easily with this application. You can choose what format or quality you would like to download in. I'm amazed by the fact that you can even download entire YouTube playlists, whether in video or audio form, straight to your phone storage. It works with YouTube as I mentioned, also Facebook, Instagram and other media streaming platforms. This application is free, it is open source so definitely no ads. If you haven't tried it yet, the link is in the video description. Just like Pixel Search, another application which got inspired by an external source is called Tab Scroll. On iPhones, there is a feature which allows its users to easily get back to the top of a page after a long manual scroll to the bottom and that with just a simple tap on the top of the screen. Similarly, tap scroll which is for Android allows its users to get to the top of the screen with a simple tap on the status bar. You can also add other gestures like double tapping to scroll down, long pressing, swiping left or right to perform certain system tasks like opening recent applications, turning on flashlights, expanding notifications and more. Jumping to customization applications often mentioned this year, Pi Launcher is definitely one of them. The unique style of this launcher has really made it go viral. The launcher has no icons or widgets on the home screen. You can only see the wallpaper you've set. Tapping and holding on the home screen will give you access to your most used applications in a spinning animation. And to be able to access all your applications, a single tap on the home screen will do just that. You can add or remove most used applications by long pressing on the application from the app drawer to place it within the most used applications which will appear on the home screen. The launcher lacks customization of the home screen, app drawer and even icon pack but I guess its unique style is what has enabled it to get a lot of mentions. Then we have Palette which is an awesome application which will inspire you as a lover of Android customization. Aside the fact that it was developed by one of the big dogs when it comes to Android tech channels, what has made this application go viral for me is its awesome functionality. Creation of super fantastic Android home screen setups is made easy due to the fact that once you come across a setup you like from the huge number of setups you come across, tapping on the mockdown screenshot will display the setup on your phone to show you how it will look on your device. And what's more interesting, is the availability of direct links to every application or tool used to create the setup including the backup file which I think is an awesome addition. Even though you have to upgrade to the premium version in order to download the backup files, I'm sure you wouldn't have an issue downloading the individual applications and setting it up yourself. With the application interface, I'm not surprised how super clean and minimal it is considering the brain behind the development of this application. First mentioned by How Two Men, this Android launcher, which has a name very hard to pronounce, has been another awesome Android application with a lot of mentions. 
The launcher style is very simple but unique. You get the time sitting boldly at the bottom of the screen and the search bar at the top. Scroll up to bring up some widgets. Swipe down to open the app drawer. You can customize the appearance of various parts of this launcher as well. Once you allow the necessary permissions, you can use the search bar to search for files, contacts or other local data and not only search for applications, which I think is a pretty awesome feature for a launcher. TrueShot is an awesome Android application which has also gained a lot of mention and is because of the incredible functionality. It allows you to neatly present screenshots instead of just dropping them when sharing them on social media. You can round the corners, add a bit of padding, add shadow. You can also upgrade to the premium version to add custom backgrounds and remove watermarks. Using our Android smartphones daily, we perform certain simple tasks, which some require third-party app installs to be able to perform such tasks. With this all-in-one application which goes by the name Thule, you can perform several little tasks like text editing when it comes to writing captions or drafting notes, various unit conversions, image tools, several calculation forms and more. I review a lot of Android applications to bring you the very best ones every month but since not all of them stays full time on my Android device, an application that I use which has also gained attraction this year is AppDrop. The application displays all your applications on your Android device and offers bulk installation. Whether you are unaware of some idle apps on your device, you can sort the apps according to the last modified and then uninstall the ones you don't normally use. You can also sort by size to see which apps takes more space on your phone. You can switch to the uninstalled tab to see all the applications you've uninstalled with AppDrop. And just like Palette, AppDrop is an application developed by Sam Beckman and again, the app UI is unsurprisingly clean and smooth. Aside these 10 viral applications, you can also find out more Android applications with great functionality when you click on this video right here. Guys, comment below your favorite applications of the year so far. If you enjoyed this video, kindly leave a like and also consider subscribing to the channel. I'll be dropping a part 2 of the best viral Android applications so you might want to see that also. As always, thank you for watching.